Honourable the Prime Minister. Oh, come on, that's, that, that's the sort of question you get at first year economics at the university. That's, that's about it. Mr. Speaker. No. No, had I, had I, I would have been a failure like you. Uh, Mr. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, I could have ended up like you. Uh, so what happened? The lemmings of the bond market sold their bonds. And when you sell a bond, let me just explain, just put this to you in ABC terms. When you sell it and the price goes down, the yield goes up. When the, the bond gets less valuable, the yield rises for a given coupon. Do you understand that? And so therefore, therefore, out of absolute, absolute failure to understand the differences between the two economies, lemming-like, they sell their bonds and the yields rise, and the government's supposed to go, oh, in that case, oh, well, in that case, we will go over the cliff with them. We'll go over the cliff with the lemmings. And we'll say, oh, we won't worry about the half million unemployed. We won't worry about a more efficient microeconomic change in the labour market. We won't worry about skill shortages and a recovery. We won't worry about compliments to skill formation. What we'll do is we'll spend the money reducing the budget deficit. Meanwhile, with no guarantee there would have been any change in interest rates, simply only that the people who are now talking their book, having sold the bonds cheaper, they're not going to now commit themselves to the fact. No, no, are now longer going to commit themselves to the fact that they can take that they can take a lower interest rate. Because if they take a lower interest rate, it means the price of the bond rises. So that magnifies the mistake which they've already made. So they're talking their book, and you want you want to regard that they're talking their book as some sort of high spiritual mystic science. That so the rest of you got to say, oh well, therefore. They're a free financial market. They must have got it right. Grow up. Grow up, for God's sake. Grow up. Mr Speaker, I ask that further questions be placed in the notice.